Hello, this is Chris with usgalaxyS3.com. I'm making this video to uh, show how to flash this uh, stock uh, Deodex version of the Sprint uh, ROM. Basically, I got this phone this weekend and I rooted it and installed a custom recovery, which pretty much took me off of the over the air update uh, track, so I'm having to do the updates manually. Uh, we found this post on XDA and it was posted by uh, Frieza. Uh, I've downloaded the update and placed it in a folder that I can locate on my device. So I'm going to go ahead and power down the device now. Let's uh, take a quick note though of the version of the software. Build number, it ends in Victor Papa Alpha Lima Echo November. I did make a titanium backup of all my stuff even though I believe it notes just flash through clockwork mod and wipe uh, Dalvik I made that back up just in case I'm gonna go ahead and unplug the device I know sometimes that causes phones to boot up I'm gonna hold volume up home and then hit power device just vibrated turned on so I let it go and here's clockwork mod base recovery 5.5.0.4 I'm gonna go install actually I'm gonna go right down here to advance like it suggested and I'm going to hit the power button to choose it up and down to move, go to wipe Dalvik, cache, confirm that, I'm going to go back, hit install zip from SD card, go choose file or zip from SD card. I placed it in a folder called Z updates just because that'll push the folder down to the bottom and keep everything uh, really neat and organized. There's my uh, Lima Fox Shot 9 LF9 uh, update full Deodex zip. I'll go ahead and confirm the install. We did try to run the over the air update just to uh, test it out and like others mentioned it does not update. It'll take the NAG uh, screen off but the update will fail to install. It'll boot up into Clockwork Mod Recovery. Since this is taking so long I probably will speed up the video during this portion. did say there though the Dalvik cache was wiped. Uh, that might have been from our last interaction with the device. Let's hit go back and now reboot system now. I know originally our Google Wallet was saying that it needed to be updated when we first received the device and we hit update and then every time we just re uh, started it up again it would say that it needed to be updated. Uh, we did just do a video on the install of the firmware uh, portion which has to be flashed uh, through Odin and after that we tried to go into Google Wallet and it, it said that it wasn't available for our carrier and this model so there was a little change now it might work after this update Let's go into my settings and go back to that about screen. What you'll notice here is that the baseband version has not been updated. It looks like the only way to currently update this is to flash the stock recovery back and accept the over-the-air update. 
In the future, someone might publish a file that will allow us to update the baseband. It will probably be uh, over Odin, or they might make a flashable uh, version through Clockwork uh, Mod Recovery. But if you look at the build number, it now ends in Victor Papa Alpha Lima Foxtrot 9. So that did, in fact, update. I'm adding this portion of the video for a couple of reasons. I may have accidentally said that the Deodex versions of ROMs are usually faster when actually the Odex versions are. Um, usually the Deodex versions are mainly for theming. It makes it a little bit easier for people to do that. We're going to check out Google Wallet now. And actually we were able to uh, get into it. Uh, this is something they said would probably work once the uh, update was installed. So we haven't tried it out yet, but at least we can get into the application. If we go back out, check our near, uh, near field communications, we'll go ahead and activate that, and we'll go find a soda machine or something to test out uh, the, NFS, the NFC on the Samsung Galaxy S3. So that was just a short video on how to do the update manually for the Sprint version of the U.S. Galaxy S3. For more information on the U.S. versions of the, U the Samsung Galaxy S3, please visit our forum, like our videos, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you.